The second in the series of the Adiola Odetola lecture attracts captains of industry, small and large-scale industrialists, all members of the Manufacturers Association of Nigeria as well as policy makers. It is a platform for contemporary discourse on industrialization as the organizer continues to engage stakeholders to achieve desired performance of the manufacturing sector. The association had always had to deal with the various challenges uh, in an economy that over the years has seen many challenges, many uh, ups and downs. It is in this regard that uh, at this annual meeting we felt that the association, its members and its guests should um, pause and look at where we have been and think of the future. Guest lecturer Alhaji Ali Kodangote takes on the subject matter, analyzing the current status of the manufacturing sector and constraints to its optimal performance. Nigeria's industrialization process has been greatly challenged by structural and institutional constraints particularly funding. These factors have over the years cumulatively contributed to its disappointing performance. For instance, in the last decade, average share of manufacturing value added to GDP in countries uh, like China and Malaysia stood at 41% and 38% respectively, compared to 14% in Nigeria. Setting the agenda for industrialization in Nigeria in the next decade, al Hajit Ngwati identifies measures that need to be put in place to accelerate the growth of the manufacturing sector. To drive industrialization and sustain economic growth in Nigeria, it is important that deliberate policies that are manufacturing specific should be designed to support manufacturing activities and address the perennial challenges of the sector. One of the highlights of the event is the unveiling of a Blueprint 2.0, a document to accelerate development of manufacturing in Nigeria. The organizers expect that key recommendations from the lecture will form the basis for the implementation of business enabling policies that will drive industrialization and economic growth.